I kid you not, Arbiter. He turns himself into a pickle. He's called Pickle Rick. It's the funniest shit I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What is going on, guys? It's Taz here, and welcome back to the channel. Now, today we've got for you guys is something that I haven't done in quite a while. We've got a reaction video today. So, if you guys weren't aware, the sort of Xbox gameplay reveal event was today, and one of the games revealed, obviously, was Halo Infinite. So, Halo Infinite is a game that I've been very, very excited for, a longtime Halo fan. A lot of the stuff in the past has looked really awesome. Just been really excited for this game. It's going to be a launch title with the Xbox Series X. It's also going to be coming out on PC where I'm going to most likely be playing it. So yeah, I mean, I've just been really excited for it and have been really looking forward to getting gameplay and everything. So today we have three different kind of trailers, I guess you could say. So one is a teaser, one is a kind of campaign trailer, and then the other is a full eight minute game demo. So we're just going to have all of these pulled up right here. I've got them all up in Vegas right now. And we're just going to go through them individually and just give you guys my reaction to it. And maybe, you know, do a little bit of breaking down at the end. So without any further ado, guys, let's just start with the first trailer here, the teaser trailer. So three, two, one, let's start it. All right, we got this uh, space station thingy water droplet or I don't know what that is actually cool stuff cool stuff is this like making making the Spartan armor possibly absolutely love that music by the way this looks a very very cool not quite sure what's happening though. The Mjolnir exosuit is now oh. complete. Yep. It's uh creating Chief's new suit. Oh, very cool, very cool. Even though this technology will save humanity in the war to come. I must remind myself. Liquid crystal cannot rise on its own. Liquid crystal. Titanium alloy cannot prevail in the face of extinction. One one seven. Master Chief's new suit. That looks really awesome. It all means nothing. Oh Until yeah. You step inside. <laughs> become Halo Infinite Holiday 2020 very cool very cool little teaser giving us a look at Chief's new suit there uh you know not much to really say about it other than that's the suit that we've seen quite a bit in the past kind of demos and trailers and everything like that it looks like it's changed a tad bit but pretty much it stayed the same I do really like how it looks like they're going back to kind of like the old art style of like Combat Evolved, Halo 2, Halo 3, uh, that kind of art style with the uh, the new suit and everything. So yeah, I mean, very awesome. Obviously, Master Chief's armor always looks pretty awesome. I know some people didn't really like it in like Halo 4, Halo 5, um, but you know, it's Chief's armor. Looks pretty awesome. Uh, let's move over to the next trailer. And I guess before we move over to that next trailer... Um, I do want to touch quickly on the sort of holiday 2020 thing. So no real release date yet for this game, but I think that that's just because, you know, everything going on, they don't want to give us a specific date and say, yeah, we're going to release it here when they're most likely not going to, because a lot of things have been delayed. So like, you know, like the destiny DLC has been delayed. They haven't even revealed the next call of duty game or anything like that. So just, being safe, covering their bases, holiday 2020. It's coming out on everything, and 
supposedly if you buy it on one console you get it on the other so if you buy it on the xbox one you get it on the series x and on windows and on windows 10 and if you buy it windows 10 you know you get it on all the xbox consoles so that's very awesome and yeah let's just move over to the next trailer Alrighty, trailer number two this is the campaign trailer very excited about this story so without any further ado let's just go Spartan. I thought you did. It is there. Ooh. Oh, grappling. Okay. Energy sword. Very cool. Ooh. It's like a banished. Yep. <laughs> Die well, Spartan. Okay, you can grapple things and toss them? That's very cool. <laughs> Become the hero. Ooh, new type of grenade. Okay, this grapple hook is crazy. <laughs> Halo Infinite. Watch the full gameplay video. Uh, yeah. We're going to in just a second, but uh, yeah, that looks pretty freaking awesome if I do say so myself. Obviously, we have eight minutes of gameplay to go through. Don't want to say too, too much about this trailer other than Master Chief on the Halo ring versus uh, the Banished, which I don't really know much about. Uh, I'm, I, I don't know too, too much about the Halo lore. I've been trying to research it a little bit, but, you know, I mean, I'm just kind of like a basic casual player i mean like i love the games but like i don't know everything about all the books and all the all that stuff there's a lot of stuff there's a lot of crazy lore in here but i know the banished are a thing and i know that's who chief is going to be fighting in this game and they're on the halo rings and uh you know you got the uh pilot bro hammer whatever whatever his name is <laughs> so yeah i mean it looks really really cool and um that grapple hook mechanic uh, was not expecting that, but very awesome. And yeah, let's just get over to the gameplay demo and get, you know, a little bit more in depth with it. So without any further ado, I keep saying that, but yeah, three, two, one, let's go. Again, love the music. Ooh, press start button to start demo. Okay, start demo. <laughs> Twenty eighth May, twenty five sixty. One sixty seven days after we lost. Yep, this is death. <laughs> no. No. No, 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 no. You got this, bro hammer. This isn't happening. <laughs> I'm going to have to make an emergency landing. Hold on, shit. Okay crash landing I would assume this is still very early on in the game no. <laughs> no. You. I can't stand this. Oh, you are free no. <laughs> you don't get to tell me anything uh, master chief tells me to breathe I'm gonna breathe Oh my god, Chief looks and sounds so cool. Safe? I haven't been safe since I found you. I found you, remember? You were out there on your own and you'd still be out there if it wasn't for me. I thought I was going home. There won't be a home if we don't stop the banished. I love the movement of this camera. It's kind of all one shot, which is really nice. I know I saw Condors over there. I'm going to dig through them and find one with the working sleep space drive. And when you're done with this war, we get away from here. <laughs> Far away. Wait here. Wait here. Please. Let me see what I can find. Cannons first. When I get back, we can look. <laughs> Together. Okay, big guy. Yes, Chief looks so good in this game. Oh my god. This game looks really good. Ooh. Very nice. Very simple HUD. 
very nice looking uh, new assault rifle. The assault rifle looks similar kind of to the Reach assault rifle, I'd say. Ooh, the uh, health recharge is pretty nice. Or shield recharge, might I say. But yeah, that's a very nice clean HUD. The game looks beautiful and kind of open worldish, which is really nice. Running. Running is back. Great. I love that. Getting in the Warthog. <laughs> Master Chief is the uh, Drift King, I guess you could say. Oh. Oh, yeah, this is, uh, this is full open world. Heard rumors, but, wow. That's awesome. This is gonna be amazing. I'm so glad that they did this with Halo. Like, I, w I was back playing on, uh, Master Chief Collection. Playing through, um, Combat Evolved and 2 and 3 and everything. And I was like, wow, if this game was open world... That'd be amazing. And it looks like that's what they're doing. Wow. Gameplay looks super fluid, by the way. Ooh. That's new. <laughs> Ooh, that's like an SMG, I think. New SMG, maybe? This just looks so good. The animations are great, by the way. Ooh, new little shield thingy. Oh, was that a... Did I just see a slide? I'm pretty sure I just saw Chief do a slide. I can't remember if that was in... Somebody tell me down in the comments, was sliding in Halo 5? I didn't play too much of Halo 5. Um... But yeah, was sliding in it? This looks so good. Oh my god, look at that draw distance. Okay, I know some people I've heard before I, I, I watched this, I saw some screenshots. Some people were saying, oh, it doesn't look that great. But like, this looks amazing. I've always wanted a Halo game to look like this and be so open like this and it looks like you have so much freedom also is it like a three round burst pulsing shotgun that's kind of cool but yeah this just looks crazy like i mean i get the the complaint that some people are saying it looks a little little flat maybe looks a little plasticky but like i think that that's just the art style it's just kind of it's, it's stylized in a way, you know? It's like, that's... I think this is just the natural evolution of what Halo should be looking like. And this is definitely the natural evolution of what Halo should be playing like. Like, look at that. You could grapple hook to things. That's cool. That's really cool. And you've got, like, a little checklist of things to do. You can grapple things to you and... That's great! Look at that. That's... That's awesome. A little brute shot cannon hand cannon thingy. That that's back too. That's nice. But yeah, like there's there's so much cool like quality of life stuff that it looks like they changed. Oh, another new shotgun too. It's a drum mag shotgun. By the way. Not sure how much you guys can hear of this. I'm not sure where I'm going to throw the audio uh, as far as levels go, but it sounds amazing, by the way. Like, just gunshots, everything sound really good. Okay. What are you doing, Chief? Ooh. Your people are broken, scattered, hunted, defeated by me. <laughs> I wish I could tell you it was. This is a little bit of the stuff that was in the uh, the first or that that uh, campaign trailer. 
We are one step ahead. Always. The rain is already under our control. Ooh. Soon, the auditorium as well. The Harbinger and the Banished share the same goal. We fight together to honor the will of Atriarchs. But without challenge, I grew weary, lost, alone. Hmm. Oh, that's kind of cool. This is my last fight. A true test of legends. Our story will outlive us both. Very cool. Set a fire in your heart, Spartan. Bear your fangs. Fight hard. Might I just say, I really hope we have a uh, a boss battle with this dude, because with all this open world stuff, I'm really hoping there are some great boss battles. And there you go, that's it. Halo Infinite Holiday 2020, available on Xbox Series X, Xbox One, and on Windows 10 PC. That, I mean, man, like, that's crazy. That is... Oh, let's just see if there's anything else at the end. No, it's just the Xbox logo. Anyway, so yeah, like that, that is crazy. I was not expecting it to be like this free. Like people were saying that we could get kind of an open world Halo game. And the last time we really saw anything similar to that was like a couple of missions in Combat Evolved where they were kind of open kind of open-ended missions where they weren't super linear. But this looks like they just drop you on this... You just get dropped on the Halo ring. And then you kind of just go wherever you want. You just... Uh, here, hold on. Where was the... Where did the map get pulled up? Oh, let's find it. Um, Map, 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 map. Where are you? Keep going. Okay, yeah. So you basically... Okay. Tac map upgrades database. Okay, so you're going to be able to upgrade stuff too. So this is, they're going full on open world. So this is open world Halo. So you just kind of, oh, okay. So you basically select, you kind of select a waypoint, it seems like. And then you, you kind of go yourself to whatever mission you want to. So it's, yeah, it's basically like any open world game it's kind of you know assassin's creed halo or something i don't know but yeah, it looks really cool so you just kind of select whatever mission you want you select your difficulty it looks like and then you just kind of you go around there's random stuff going on in the world you got enemies to fight people dropping in um but yeah like it's vast it's open there it just it looks so good like, here, let's keep playing it a little bit. But, yeah, like, this looks amazing. Like, I keep saying that. But, what else is there really to say other than... 343 has really outdone themselves with this game. I know we've been waiting a while for Infinite. But I definitely think it's been worth the wait. Like, it, just the atmosphere and the music... And the gameplay is so smooth, and you've got the grappling hook to traverse, and you can pick things up and throw them at enemies, and, like, it's... It's crazy. Like, it really is. I mean... And then you've got all these dudes... I don't know. I'm just I'm just kind of talking randomly now. I should, I should probably wrap this up so it doesn't end up being a super long video. But yeah, anyway, just overall thoughts with me just not trying to ramble here. Is it just, the game looks amazing. Uh, the story seems like it's going to be great. Whoever this brute banished dude is seems like obviously he's the big bad. Uh, like I said, hopefully we get some boss battles in this game because it's so open world. Uh... You know, 
getting some Destiny vibes, you know? A little bit, maybe, possibly, with this open world stuff, but yeah, we were we were hoping that it was going to be open world, we were expecting that it was going to be open world, and it seems like it is, so that's great. The environments look great, gameplay looks great, super fluid, Master Chief is back in action, looking amazing, cannot wait to play this game. I think this is going to be amazing to play with friends too, but yeah, overall, Halo Infinite looks absolutely insane. Going to be getting this on PC for sure. It looks great. There's not much else to say. Don't really know how to wrap this up other than by saying, just let me know what you guys think about this down there in the comments. Were you expecting Halo Infinite to be this free and open and expecting it to be this much of an open world game? Like, who would have thought that Halo would have evolved into that? But, like I said, I guess it's just kind of the natural evolution of this game. Like, where else would you go other than an open world Halo game? And it looks amazing, it sounds amazing, it seems like it plays really well too. So just let me know what you guys think about this down there in the comments below. Has Halo Infinite kind of sold you on a new Xbox? For me, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to buy a Series X because you can play this on PC and it's going to look just as good, if not maybe better on PC too. So I don't know. They've got to have some great incentives to play it on Xbox if they want me to buy an Xbox Series X, you know, but that's just me. So anyway, let me know what you guys think about this game down there in the comments below. Does this make you more hyped for the game? Did you expect it to look like this? Did you expect it to play like this? Just let me know your thoughts on everything down there in the comments below. But until next time, guys, it's been Taz, and I'll see you guys in the next video.